Hello and welcome to the official match coverage of Chichester Men's Football Ones versus the Kent Ones. I'm your commentator Hector Clements and I'm joined on commentary today by Jeremy Jesbo Slice Chorley. What are your thoughts ahead of today's game, Jez? Well, I think the ones are, it's going to be quite an easy game for the ones as they've been really on really good form recently. Yeah, um, the ones have been a high flyers in the league and let's hope they can continue that today on home turf. Tough game against Kent, but they tend to assert their dominance at home. Big crowd in spectation today and let's hope they can do it, Jez. Well, yeah, Callum scored I think a few weeks ago and that was a really good that was a really good and that was a really good result for the ones, but very good result for the ones and they'll be looking to build on that today. Kent in their white and purple strip, Chichester in their all all blue home strip. Oh, oh well that's the keeper's taken way too long there! Would you believe that the keepers had an absolute nightmare and the striker for Kent has stolen in and tucked it away. You won't see an easier finish than that. There's the celebration. A nightmare start for the ones, Jez. Well, they just that yeah, was just silly from the keeper. He should have cleared it. He should have got... Well, here goes Liss from the free kick. Oh, just wide. Well, that was a fine effort by Liss. Just wide of the post. But let's go back to that opening goal, Jez. Calamitous. Yeah, it was really calamitous. Keeper should have really booted it downfield. Well, here's Liss again for the ones. Oh. That's two shots now for Liss. That's a great He's the one trying to pull the strings work. for the ones and drag them back into this game, but that was straight down the keeper's throat and well kept out. But here's Lucas Jones. It's Might try his luck at the half volley. Oh. Great effort. My God, Lucas Jones nearly put one in the back of the net, surely. Good technique to keep it down, tipped over them from the keeper. And that's a great it ball in. Is. And here's Iffy with a chance. Oh, my goodness. Well, it's all the ones now. The keeper spilled it, spilled it out of his hands, but luckily he grabs hold of it and take good, good save by the keeper. Chichester ones trying to work their way back in, but Kent with another chance, driven across goal, well kept out. Yeah, it's a great save from Ash Downs again. It's love, pushed it, pushed away out of play. Well done, Ash Downs, big save. If he, he's looking for that one opportunity, and he fed his man there, and it's come off the post. And is it going to be in at the second time of asking? It's not. It looked as if that shot was going nowhere near, but it ended up creeping onto the post, and that's the closest Chichester have come. Corner comes in, oh, well up, but well saved. Straight down the keeper's throat there. That was a, that should have been aimed more into the bottom left to see if he could get a get an equaliser there. Oh, a chance! Surely the rebound. Oh my lord! Just Ken, right. The this keepers. End-to-end -end stuff from Ken. The keepers parried it into his path. Came with him at pace, but he should have done better there. And the earlier chance... Oh, another chance. God, it's raining chances here. I was about to comment on Iffy's earlier chance. He tried to stab it home, and he couldn't quite do that. And Chichester have just missed another opportunity. Here goes Feast running in. Can he feed his man, Kelvin? Ooh. Robinson just wide, and that was a big opportunity. And you can see what it means to Iffy there. He can't quite believe it. Yeah, he's, he's looking shot that Kelvin did not finish that. Great opportunity. And Kent again, well saved. A thumping effort, stings the keeper's palms, but Kelvin with the best chance there. And he was slightly off balance, and there's another chance off the bar. Was the linesman about to raise his flag? Here's a free kick, Lucas Jones loops it in. There it is! Oh, Emmett Dunno, Dunno, done, done. <laughs> Emmett done. You're done though. <laughs> you're done though, you're done though, you're Emmett done, and you put that. <laughs> Alright, enough, of, into enough the of the puns, it's Emmett done. He climbs above his man and he bullets it past the keeper, no chance. There's the knee slide, and it's been coming for Chichester. They've been on top, and done unmarked at the back post, and he thumps one past the keeper, and now it's a free kick. It's a chance for Jones! Oh, fine effort. He'd beaten the wall, but he couldn't quite beat the man in the green. Yeah, it looked like it. if that chance had gone in, it would be game, set, match. Chichester men's one. Corner. Emmett done! There it is! He's done it again! Oh, it's another high-flying shot from Emmett. Done, oh, done, done, done. <laughs> Emmett done with the knee slide. The Canadian, the Chichester City man. It's he's been in fine form in green and white, and now he's done it in blue. Chichester have turned it on its head right on the 85th minute mark, and Emmett Dunn's the man. 2-1. It's game, set, match. Chichester men's ones here. He climbs above his man at the back post. He gets his noggin on it, and he wheels away in celebration. His parents are here to watch. No, they're not. They're not here to watch, but who cares? 
he celebrated in style. Great finish. Yes, get well. That's the nail in the coffin for me. It's another chance. What a finish, Alfie Liss. Fantastic shot. Except that looked like a bit of a rugby conversion. Surely he missed so much. He he was. How wide does he actually want the goal? I mean, that was so far wide. And there it is. There is the whistle. A topsy-turvy encounter between these two sides. Chichester found themselves 1-0 down at the break, but they've come back to claim the three points on home, t home turf. And they deserved it in the end. Emmett Dunn was the hero. Two headed goals in the second half to turn this game around. They were made to work for the three points here, but they've done it. And they continue their recent surge of form that's seen them near the top of the table. And that's all for today. Thank you very much for joining us. Me, me Jeremy Jesbo Chorley and him, Hector Clements, for this wonderful game. We'll see you sometime soon. Always a pleasure. Never a chore. Splendid. Oh, Charlie, you bit my finger. Yes. <laughs>